Good morning. Uh, my name is William White uh, with Scarpi de Bianco. We are in the warehouse today, so we're pulling back the curtain, doing a little bit of uh, product information for fall 2018. Um, a couple basics. First of all, uh, Scarpe means uh, shoes in Italian. Uh, de Bianco is my last name in Italian. Uh, started in 2009, and uh, we've been making shoes in Italy. Uh, for the last 10 years. Um, I think our focus has always been classic shoes with a modern twist and uh, we're going to go through the different collections this morning and talk about some of the key selling points for them. So this is the SB105 which is a wingtip Oxford in reverse sombrero and this has actually been our collection for uh, since the very beginning so for 10 years and it continues. Um, this is far, part of the premium collection um, and you can tell which uh, which of the shoes are from the premium collection because it has a bicolor sole, gray and, and moro. Uh, it has our signature uh, metal plate on the sole, stamped premium, and it actually has a gray lining. Um, and the beautiful thing about this shoe is really great coloration and it's got a little bit of extra detailing here and our chiseled square toe. So this is uh, the SBP 945 um, in Marmo. This is another Oxford with uh, what I call naked uh, uh, broguing because as you can see the broguing here is a little bit heavier. Um, this one here actually what I've done is I've stripped down um, some of the stitching so it's a little bit of a lighter effect. And this is in the Marmo color which is probably our number one selling color uh, company wide because it's great with navies and great with blues. Um, this is a uh, interesting uh, kind of a squared off wing tip. So a little bit of a different uh, pattern there and that's a great burgundy color. Um, SBP 901 and um, this is a blucher. These uh, fit somebody who has a very high instep very well because as you can see this extra flap of leather will open up here which accommodates uh, the high instep. So we do both of those um, uh, on a consistent basis. Marmo color and also in a stone gray, which is a very interesting pewter color which you don't see very often. Double monk strap, uh, we've done that in textures. Um, this is the Scotch grain stone, and um, what's nice about this is it's great if you put it with a solid suit, uh, brings up the suit because it shows a little bit of uh, added texture. Uh, we also did it here in a peccary, peccary print in uh, anima, which is a, a deep oxblood color. So that's a nice, unique uh, combination. And then um, this is a model here, the SBP897, that's sort of um, an update to a classic penny strap. But what we've done here is it's a cross strap. And this is a bit of a signature look for DiBianco. And we do this in all of our collections. So uh, this season, we're focused on the stone gray. Um, we've got a suede gray and a navy blue. Next, we've got the SB405. And this is from the DiBianco collection. And this we did in a bologna construction. The beauty of the bologna is it's extremely flexible. Still has a leather sole. Uh, the leather sole we've done thick enough so you get enough support when you're walking. And it has a metal shank. Um, but it's very flexible, which means it's very comfortable. Um, and we've done these in three options. Uh, chocolate suede, chocolate Napa, and a black Napa. And those are $7.95 retail. All these models are new for fall 2018. These are the uh, SPQR collection. SPQR uh, stands for Senatus Populus Romanus, which is the old Roman Senate. So we play off of the uh, sound of its uh, pronunciation, which is sport. And the sport collection um, all have uh, high density rubber soles. They're done in a flex construction. So very flexible again, still has the metal shank and it also has a Technogel inner sole. Technogel uh, comes from Germany and this is a silicon based gel. Uh, never hardens, never breaks down and it's extremely comfortable. So in terms of uh, new models this fall, uh, we've got one in a Dano Napa which has, um, it's nice and soft, again really flexible and what we did is we lightened up the guardalo here to make it a little sportier. Um, this is an Espresso Velour, and this is a uh, nice color for fall. And what we did here is we lightened the Guardalo again, but we also put a uh, layer of uh, red 
red rubber. I call it the red stripe. Um, and that makes a really nice sporty effect. So we've done that in a few instances. Um, here's another one where we've taken an Oxford um, wingtip and uh, put the red stripe on a uh, mountain sole, so it's got that sort of chunkier look, but it's an ultralight uh, sole, so extremely comfortable. I've got a uh, wingtip here, and this is actually on our stack sole. And the nice thing about the stack sole is when you're actually wearing it, the profile isn't very heavy. Um, and it's still um, nice and comfortable because it has the gel. It's a little little stiffer um, because of the extra stacking, but uh, I think it's a really on-trend look right now, and we did this in the chisel uh, square toe. Uh, continuing with the stack sole, did a double monk's drop in uh, chocolate suede. Uh, again, lighten up the Gordolo, um, and I think that's uh, beautiful for fall. And a Chelsea boot, we did this in a Psyche Velour, so a uh, really sophisticated color. Stack sole again. Um, this is great with jeans, or you could dress this up. Then we did a peccary uh, print uh, with the red stripe uh, chuck a boot. Um, great for fall in terms of you could wear this with uh, light colors, you can wear it with dark colors, uh, textured uh, pants, um, or just about anything in your wardrobe. Next we've got uh, the Gallo Collection, Di Bianco Gallo, and this is our opening price point, generally $5.95 to $6.95. Um, the interesting thing we've done here is that we're now producing all of the, um, the shoes in the Comfort Flex construction, which uh, means that it's, uh, we've slightly thinned down the sole, which gives a little more flexibility, um, and also the construction we've taken a little bit out of the, um, the midsole. Um, two models uh, in scotch grain. Both of these we've lightened up the, the guardalo to make it a little sportier. Um, and we have a combination sole. So we've got some rubber plug and we've got uh, leather. So a little bit sportier. Great for fall. Then uh, we've got two loafers. Uh, this is the marble color. And this is one of our best selling colors again just because excellent with jeans or you could uh, grays and blues and these have got the full leather soles. And then we've got an antique gold um, tassel loafer with some uh, piping on the side, a uh, nice color. Um, this is a fun color for fall. This is a leccio, and this, is, uh, this green's been very strong with the uh, contrast stitching. Again, we lighten up the guardalo. Again, these are all the flex construction. Um, and we've always done very well with our ankle boots, so we did this one in a gray for this fall. Uh, Di Bianco sneakers, uh, new models for fall. A um, few things about our sneakers uh, in general is that these are fully lasted shoes, so they're actually sewn. Um, it has a cork inner bedding and it has an extra thick um, inner sock, so very comfortable. Uh, slightly wider last, so uh, generally this will fit everybody. Uh, on the rare occasion, if someone doesn't have a very meaty uh, foot, they may have to size down a half size. So for fall, we've got uh, gunmetal and a slightly uh, gray sole uh, with two different uh, uh, velour and leather gray. Um, nice thing here is we put on an extra guardalo, which is a separate piece of leather that we sew around the entire uh, shoe. Then we've got uh, asphalt gray velour on our designer sole, uh, which has kind of got that sort of sportier, Yeezy sort of feel. Uh, we did well with this in a lighter color for spring, so we've continued that. Um, then we've got a cappuccino here, and we've done again a combination of um, calfskin and velour. And this is on a tan uh, sole, two level sole, very comfortable. Um, and then this particular model, uh, we've continued this through fall, uh, did extremely well with these before. Um, and these have the uh, two level sole as well. Uh, and we did this with the metal eyelets, and we've got a nice uh, uh, brown and navy. Um, and the nice detailing on the back there you can see is that we've put a leather piece uh, with our uh, two-shoe icon. Uh, 